بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم اسٹوڈنٹس ان دا لاسٹ ویڈیو وی آر ڈسکسنگ اباؤٹ دا ملٹیپلیٹ پیٹرنس اپٹینڈ ان ویریس آئن سسٹمس نو ٹوڈے وی ول ڈسکس اباؤٹ دا ریگولر اینڈ ریگولر ملٹی پلیٹس فسٹ آف آل اف وی ٹاک اباؤٹ دا ریگولر ملٹی پلیٹس دیز آر دا ملٹی پلیٹس ان وچ the lower j values lies lower in energy this kind of pattern is usually observed in those system which are less than half filled while conversely speaking to this regular multiplet if we talk about the irregular multiplets then these are the multiplets in which higher j values spectroscopic terms having higher j values fall lower in energy or lies lower in energy so these kind of multiplets will be observed in those cases where the electronic configuration is greater than half filled for example p4 system d6 system d7 system while in case of regular multiplets you will observe in p1 system d1 system p2 system d2 system the case study of regular multiplets now another concept here arises regarding the multiplicity pattern of these multiplets that is orbitally degenerate orbitals and let us talk about what are the orbitally degenerate or non degenerate orbitals for example you have p and you know well that p subshell further contains three orbitals that is px py and pz then you can say that these three p's are the orbitally degenerate orbitals or orbitally degenerate system while in case of s that is orbitally non degenerate this is because when these non orbitally <coughs> degenerate systems will be placed in the higher magnetic field there will be no kind of splitting pattern observed over here now for as an example we have a d2 system which contains following spectroscopic terms these are the f triplet f triplet and p triplet these are the triplet terms with respect to spin multiplicity and these are the singlet terms this is a representation of the splitting pattern in case of d2 system here note that student specially number 1 coupling is spin spin coupling and number 2 pattern of coupling is orbit orbit coupling and number 3 pattern is spin orbit coupling and at the fourth stage you will get the mj values now we come to this point first when spin and spin coupling takes place these triply and singly degenerate systems are get separated and you see here that triplets fall lower in energy and singlets fall higher in energy remember this this pattern of splitting is in accordance to the regular multiplet system while in irregular multiplet system this kind of pattern is not observed as is apparent that this p having further spectroscopic terms that is p triplet 0 p triplet 1 and p triplet 2 and it is apparent from this splitting that lower j value falls lower in energy energy as we are dealing here over here with d2 system and you know well that d2 system is less than half filled 
then a regular kind of multiplet will be observed over here so come to this point that is spin spin coupling is giving us the singlets and triplets now if we further move in accordance to the orbit orbit coupling this this was the second rule that if the spin degeneracy is same then the spectroscopic or the term symbols having higher l value will fall lower in energy and it is apparent that g has the l value 4 which is lower in energy as compared to d and s singlets in a similar pattern in case of triplets this p will be supplanted higher in energy and p triplet f triplet falls lower in energy this is also in accordance to that principle that term symbols having greater l value will fall lower in energy hence f triplet is lower in energy as compared to p triplet now we will observe the third kind of coupling pattern which is the spin orbit coupling and we will start from here that is this s singlet has l0 s0 and ultimately you will get a spectroscopic term which is s singlet 0 similarly in d system in d singlet l value is 2 s value is 0 and according to the russell saunders coupling or ls coupling 2 plus 0 2 and ultimately 2j value will be obtained so spectroscopic term would be d singlet 2 similarly in case of g singlet you will get g singlet 4 here again 1j value which is 4 is obtained that is 4 plus 0 4 and this will be placed over here and if we talk about the p, p triplet system p has a azimuthal value which is l value which is 1 and s value which is also 1 you will get three spectroscopic terms that is p triplet 2 p triplet 1 p triplet 0 and if we move towards the f triplet f triplet will also have three spectro spectroscopic terms which are f triplet 4 f triplet 3 and f triplet 2 so after this spin orbit coupling phenomena we will move towards the fourth stage where these spectroscopic terms when placed in strong magnetic field will give us the splitting patterns in their orbitals or you can say by the help of these mj values you will be able to calculate the total degeneracy of the system in this d2 system remember this 45 degeneracies will be observed and we can conclude that 4, 45 degeneracy orbitals by observing observing these separating patterns now let us move towards the mj value here you have the j value 0 if you place 0 into this formula that is 2, 2j plus 1 you will get only one separating and that is this one and similarly in case of d singlet 2 you will get you will have five further splittings in this spectroscopic term and ultimately it is apparent from this separating pattern that is minus 2 minus 1 0 plus 1 plus 2 these are the total five degeneracies in this d singlet 2 term similarly in case of g singlet 4 you will have 2j plus 1 that is 9 and here you will get 9 spectro further in this spectroscopic term you will have 9 further splittings in the stronger magnetic field you can write over here that from s singlet 1 from d singlet 2 you are getting 5 similarly from g singlet 4 you are getting 9 p triplet 2 5 p triplet 1 3 
P triplet 0, you are getting only one J value. Similarly, in case of F triplet 4, you are getting nine M J values. In case of F triplet 3, you are getting seven and F triplet 2, you are getting five. Then aggregate of these all M J values will give us 45 number total. You can add also these over here. That is one plus five plus 9 plus 5 plus 3 plus 1 plus 9 plus 7 and plus 5 you will have 14 5 orbital degeneracy for this d2 system i and for observing the separating pattern over here we will have to erase this pattern now let us move ahead by erasing this separating pattern of this uh, singular terms now we will observe the multiplicity pattern in p triplet terms now let us see about this i would like to erase it now look at this spectroscopic term of uh, p triplet 2 you are getting over here 5 mj values now let we observe over here that is that is 0 minus 2 minus 1 plus 1 plus 2 then 5 mj values are obtained over here similarly in p3 or p triplet 1 system you will get three separatings or you can show over here that is like this that is minus one plus one in p triplet zero you will have only one term one mj value similarly after a, a view of this uh, Separating in P triplet system, we will now move towards F triplet system. I will have to erase this pattern. So, first of all, I would show it over here. That is, nine MJ values are observed. I would like to draw these in this pattern. Four plus four nine. So. Similarly, in F triplet system, you will get seven separating patterns that is one, two, three, one, two, and three. And if we talk about F triplet two spectroscopic term, then we will have five splitting patterns that is like this and you can also place the magnetic values that is minus two minus one zero plus one plus two here you are observing seven splitting patterns and you can also place over here their values that is minus three minus two minus one zero plus 1 plus 2 plus 3 and similarly if we move towards the splitting pattern of f triplet f triplet 4 spectroscopic term you will get nine splitting patterns and their magnetic values will would be in this pattern that is minus 4 minus 3 minus 2 minus 1 0 plus 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 so overall over here is 9 and here 7 and you are getting here over here 5 so this was all about the orbital or you can say the total degeneracy of the d2 system which is having 45 levels and in the next article we will talk about the 
microstates what are the microstates and their analysis in various systems thank you very much